Christmas is a joyful time. There's the shrieks of children and laughter, and it's a time of recognizing again the importance of the mystery of loving, and that love is never love until we learn to forgive and to receive, and to learn that ultimately we are deeply and profoundly loved. As Albert Einstein reminded us, every day is a mystery that unfolds for us, and how we receive life every day and give thanks for it and live it in, t- in spite of its mistakes and complexities is ultimately what matters. And so Christmas is a time where God gets under our skin and says to us, I love you profoundly, deeply, more than your imaginings. And so learn to live in that love, and that when mistakes happen in love, don't hold them, don't hold resentments. Learn that forgiveness actually frees you to new life. And that's what this awesome little baby in Bethlehem tells us, for he lives and dies on the cross, in fact, to tell us what ultimately matters in life. And what about the new year? Do you have any particular hopes, both uh, publicly or, or even personally, for the new year? I mean, I hope that as an Australian society we learn to be more forgiving of each other, that we live by certain principles in, in terms of truth and justice, that we see every life across this planet as a life that is worth living for and living with, uh, that we are open our shows, as our national anthem says, you know, those who come from afar, and that we treat people with dignity and respect when they come here. Sure. Uh, and uh, for Western Australia, are there any particular um, New Year messages um, that you'd like to see in, in Western Australian life? I mean, Western Australia is a wonderful place, and it has this remarkable ability, I think, to live both between the the sea and the desert, and it provides a beautiful borderline, in fact, for us to live with certain elements of risk, but also not to live life in such a way that we harm other people. And so I pray and hope that as we in Western Australia celebrate uh, 2012, that we will take care of ourselves take care of other people, but above all, uh, learn deeply the mystery of what it is to be loved.